Word on the street is Shannon Sharp is leaving Skip Bayless for Undisputed. Let's get into the topic. What's poppin'? It's your boy Zulgin and welcome to the Mother Freakin' Show. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and all that other mother freaking good stuff. Now, I'm going to add a sports section to this channel because the Skip Bayless short got 13,000 views that I did. And the other Skip Bayless video I did, um, it got thousands, uh, what, over 7,000 views? Yeah, seven, almost 8,000 views on the other one. And it's a lot of controversy surrounding Skip Bayless and Shannon Sharp. They're saying Shannon Sharp is about to up and leave because Shannon Sharp's uh, his podcast is doing really good on YouTube. Um, his channel almost has a, a, a million views called Club Shay Shay. And I really like his channel, man. I like the interviews he does. I just like Shannon Sharp is all around just a good person. Now, a lot of people are saying Skip Bellis was putting him in his place as far as... Um, you know, Negro get in line, Negro get in place, or Negro, you better not say anything out of line, or I'm going to embarrass you and I'm going to disrespect you. Or Negro, you can keep your job as long as you stay in line, like I tell you. And it sort of looked like that. It really did. Because Shannon Sharp, as you can see in the video, he was really hurt by the attacks of, uh, what's your boy name? Um, Skip Bellis. Skip Bellis really gave him a personal attack because he's trying to protect the image of Tom Brady because Tom Brady's playing like pure trash this year, pure garbage. Now, Skip Bellis can say anything he want about any other black athlete, any other athlete he can say. He says the craziest stuff about any athlete he wants to. But anytime you criticize Tom Brady, he has an issue, like he's almost being paid to protect Tom Brady's image, even though Tom Brady is playing like garbage. Now, they had a segment and everybody saw it, it went viral. And it's still getting a lot of views on my channel. And a lot of people saying Shannon is leaving. A lot of other people are saying Shannon should leave. And I'm, let me tell you something. I think their show has run its course. And let me tell you why. After that video, after that 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 uh, 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 altercation they had live, you can't even look at this show differently because you see what really going on here. A lot of people said Shannon Sharp be buck dancing or Shannon Sharp is, you know, he, now he gonna be a house nigger or whatever you wanna call it. Or uh, people are saying if he didn't check Shannon, uh, if he didn't check uh, uh, Skip Bayless that, um, you know, he's kissing the white man's behind. And um, a lot of people think that Shannon Sharp, that he, uh, what do you call it? Um, he wants to be accepted by white media or by white society. That's what some people are saying. I don't know if that's true or not, but it could be true or it could be not. But as you can see, Skip Bell has crossed the line, letting Shannon Sharp know if you get out of line in his eyes, which Shannon Sharp didn't say anything out of line. Shannon Sharp just told the truth about Tom Brady playing like trash. But on, on that show, they have an agenda to keep Tom Brady's image intact. So that's that's what all that was about. Tom Brady's image, you don't say, you don't criticize him, you don't say nothing about Tom Brady, nothing at all. Um, so uh, Tom Brady is trash, he's playing like garbage. Yes, he's one of the greatest players of football, yes. But you cannot uh, violate a man or attack another man like that and disrespect the man because you don't like his opinion or you don't like the truth that he spoke. That's what's my How can Shannon Sharp say, I mean, how can Skip Bayless say whatever, whatever he want to say about people? But especially black athletes and nobody's, you know, nobody taking a personal attack on Skip Bayless, how he was a trash, how he was a trash athlete. Just a trash athlete, just garbage. He wasn't good. And he and Skip Bellis is a what you call it a uh, he sells controversy, um, you know he he, he he's he's controversial because people like controversy. That's what he sells. I think he's good at that selling controversy, and that's basically it. So to say that Shannon Sharp was nothing, so what? He was in the Hall of Fame, so what? Shannon Sharp, you were a great player, but you weren't better than Tom Brady. How can he say that? I mean, those are two different positions, and. Um, Shannon Sharp was a monster of a tight end. 
Like, he's one of the greatest tight ends ever played a game. Like, Jalen Sharp was a beast. Him and his brother. Like, stop playing. Like, that dude, not, Shannon Sharp ain't just in the Hall of Fame. Shannon Sharp is a legend. Like, stop playing. His style of play, what he brought to the tight end position, you, you didn't really, you didn't see nothing like that. Especially back then where it was way tougher. NFL was way tougher back then. So he, he grew up in an era where he was, I mean, Shannon Sharp was a different kind of animal. I mean, he was, he was bred different. And he just totally disrespected Shannon, uh, Shannon Sharp's career. He disrespected him as a man. He disrespected him as what he stood for. And I don't think Shannon Sharp should be on the show. I think Shannon Sharp should leave and just do uh, Club Shay Shay. Or, you know, get on another, uh, how can I put it? Get on another uh, uh, NFL uh, uh, talk show or whatever the case may be. Um, let me tell you something. Skip Bellis, to keep that show going, him and Shannon Sharp, the chemistry they had and everything else, for them to for, for Skip Bellis to destroy that, um, his show won't be the same if Shannon Sharp leaves. Now, if Shannon Sharp leaves that show, Skip Bellis is in trouble because the sports media and everybody else, they don't really care for Skip. They don't really care for him. And it's bad enough that they didn't really care for him. And then live on TV, he disrespects a black man as honorable as Shannon Sharp. He's very uh, honorable man. He never, he never, I mean, Shannon Sharp gives his opinion. He speaks the truth. Shannon Sharp doesn't disrespect nobody and try to step on nobody's toes. And Skip Bellis, he crossed that line. So, Skip Bellis, your show won't be the same because um, you destroyed that relationship with this man because you don't want nobody to say nothing about Tom Brady and how he's garbage this year. Not to take away from Tom Brady not being a great player because I, I believe he's a great player, but he's garbage this year. And that's just the fact. And it's like, it's like Skip Bellis don't want to come to the realization that Tom Brady's time is up. They want to make it seem like Tom Brady can play forever. He's never going to get old. He's always going to play at a high level no matter how old he gets. And that's a lie. Tom Brady can't carry a team like he used to. Tom Brady doesn't he doesn't have the athleticism. Tom Brady is slowing down. Tom Brady's reflexes aren't the same. He's throwing a lot of interceptions this year. Um, he's not even really being a good leader this year. So it's a lot of things coming into play with Tom Brady. And that's crazy how Skip Bell could criticize everybody else but him. And that lets you know on that show there's an agenda to protect Tom Brady's image. Um, time is up, Tom Brady. It's time for you to give it up. It's time for you to retire. Tom Brady should have uh, retired after he won that last Super Bowl and saved his marriage and his family. Um, that's what I believe. But um, a lot of people are saying Shannon Sharp is leaving. I think Shannon Sharp should leave. Um, whether this is uh, true or rumor, I think this this is about to happen. I think after that, Shannon Sharp is like, you know what? This, this is a wrap. I've been on this show long enough. And to be honest... Shannon Sharp brings a lot to the show and a lot of people watch Undisputed because of Shannon Sharp. Yeah, because of Skip Bayless too. But I think the audience got bigger because of who Shannon Sharp is and the type of, uh, you know, game analyst that he is. He's really good at analyzing games. He's a Hall of Famer. He knows what he's talking about on a lot of topics. And I think Skip Bayless don't like the fact that um, Shannon Sharp has a lot of knowledge of the game because he plays, he played the game. And he's a Hall of Famer. He's not a Hall of Famer for no reason. You have to study the game. You got to know the game. You got to know the plays. You got to know how to run routes. You got to know what the defense is doing. You got to read defenses. You got to know how to get open. You got to know how to separate. You got to know these things. And, and to have this type of knowledge and the, the level of play that Shannon Sharp played, he always played at a higher level. That's just who Shannon Sharp is. For him to say that he retired at 35, so what? It was, that, that was his choice to retire at 35. And just because he retired at 35 and Tom Brady, you know, he's 45. How does that take away from the greatness <laughs> of Shannon Sharp? OK, so I believe their time is up. Put your thoughts in the comments and, in, 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 you know, and let's make a discussion in the comments section. Um, should Shannon Sharp leave? Do you believe he's leaving? Is that just a rumor? Is that true? Because I really believe that's true. Um, I believe he's he's about to go. I'm not saying he he may leave after this season. I believe this is his last season with with, with Skip Bayless. I believe after this, I believe he's gone, and I think he should leave and move on. And I think Skip Bayless, um, is he he he's he burnt the bridge that he should have never burned. That's just what I believe. I'm out of here. Let me know what y'all think, man. I see this this is getting a lot of views on my channel, so I guess I add a live show sports segment 
and talk about certain stuff. And I'm out of here.